Hey, I'm Claire Barnett and this is IQ, where we stop first year students on the Commons and ask them intellectual questions. This week's question is, do American citizens have a moral obligation to vote in federal elections? Let's see what Vanderbilt first years have to say. For the United States to work as it was constructed, the people have to be able to voice their opinions and the, one of the only ways that Americans could do that is by voting. I don't think it should be a required thing, but I think it should be recommended. It's our civic duty. Voting is part of uh, the social contract we signed with the American democracy. It's tough really to say just a direct yes or no answer because there's a lot of facts that really come to mind. Firstly, I think about how insignificant a popular vote can be and then what is the popular vote as a whole seeing as electoral college takes precedence over that but then beyond that how minute you are within the popular vote I do think that we have a moral obligation to vote just because uh, a lot of people think that their vote won't count because you know electoral college and everything and I think that's like kind of crap because your vote does matter um, I think American citizens do have a moral obligation to vote I think um, people say that they have, like, people, Americans have the right to vote. I'd like to think of it more as we have the responsibility to vote. In New York City, Mayor, Mayor de Blasio, I think he had something like 7% of, like, 7% of the people that actually lived in New York City actually voted for him to be mayor of that city. So think about it, if the entire city is being governed by someone that only 7% voted for, is that really what the Founding Fathers wanted?